hello everyone welcome to my channel asp.net core today uh, i'm going to show you how to use ad.net features in asp.net core so here we have uh, a products controller and uh, in which we have a index method and just i want to know uh, or you can say um, uh, how to get products uh, or you can say how to retrieve data from database table so get product is a method uh, there is and that return a uh, list of products and that product uh, get from the database table so uh, use i configurations uh, file uh, interface uh, for making connection string uh, for, to the uh, app settings short session file so uh, you can use list of products that line uh, use sql connection for creating a connection with the database server and uh, use uh, that property of the uh, sql connection class that is connection string and get connection string that is the default connection string that is available in uh, app settings dot json file there is the name of the connection string is default connection so uh, here we have and after we can use sql command and uh, command text is select a strict from the all products and command dot execute reader and rd dot read all the products one by one product add into the uh, list of products so there is products dot add new product in in which and id name and the details after that we can close uh, the connection and return the products after uh, return the products uh, you can send that products uh, to the uh, view uh, to the view so uh, just check the view of the products controller you we have a simple razor uh, page and you can say use tag helpers sorry uh, use the razor pages so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to asp.net core and much more uh, remaining in asp.net core so please subscribe my channel uh, channel and uh, also press the bell icons thank you very much for watching